You stupid. They're not. What's 9 plus 10? 21? You stupid! Wrong, sir. This little man is not stupid. In fact, I believe he's one of the most ingenious mathematicians of his age. And I think I finally figured out the genius of this mathematical pioneer. So I think most of us think that 9 plus 10 equals 19. But you're wrong, you absolute fool, you imbecile. It's actually 21, and you should be ashamed of yourself for thinking otherwise. Now let me show you why. So I think all of us can agree that 9 plus 10 is equal to 9 plus 10. And I think that we can also agree that 10 is equal to 8 plus 2, so let's just expand this a little bit. Now let's get rid of the 8 plus 9 on both sides first, and as you can see the equality is still true, 2 is indeed equal to 2. Now let's also multiply both sides by 2. I think we can all agree 2 times 2 equals 2 times 2. And also remember, 2 times 2 is equal to 2 to the power of 2. Don't believe me? Check it on your calculator. Now let's subtract 2 to the power of 2 from both sides. As you can see, the equality is still true. Now let's factor out the 2 from the left side. If you don't know what factoring is, all you need to know is that 2 times 2 minus 2 is equal to 2 times 2 minus 2 to the power of 2. If you don't believe me, again, check on your calculator. And remember, 2 times 2 minus 2 to the power of 2 is equal to 2 to the power of 2 minus 2 to the power of 2, so we can say that 2 times 2 minus 2 is equal to 2 to the power of 2 minus 2 to the power of 2. And 2 to the power of 2 minus 2 to the power of 2 itself is actually equal to 2 minus 2 times 2 plus 2. To understand why, we have to look at a mathematical rule called the difference of squares. And this basically says that the difference of any two numbers taken to the power of 2, a and b are our numbers, is equal to a minus b times a plus b. And in this case, a is equal to 2, and b is also equal to 2. So all this works out to 2 times 2 minus 2, equaling 2 minus 2 times 2 plus 2. Again, if you don't believe me, check your calculator. Now we're going to divide both sides by 2 minus 2, and the equality will still be true because if there's any equation where both sides of the equation have the same factor, then you can divide those both by the same factor, which is in this case 2 minus 2, or in the generalized equation I'm showing you, a. So we can divide both sides by a to get b equals c, or in this case, 2 equals 2 plus 2. Again, if you don't believe me, try out this equation with your own calculator with different numbers. So now we got 2 equals 2 plus 2. Now let's go back to the beginning of all this and take back that 8 plus 9, and we're going to add it back to both sides of the equation. And so this gives us 9 plus 8 plus 2 equals 2 plus 2 plus 8 plus 9. And if we simplify that down, we get to 9 plus 10 equals 21. And there you have it, a mathematical proof as to why 9 plus 10 equals 21. And to think that this kid did all of this in his head in just a split second. He is truly a genius, a god among men. Now this vine is like 8 years old, so this kid is probably out there in the world right now revolutionizing the field of mathematics. Now here's something else incredible about this genius kid. 9 plus 10 wasn't only a revolutionary mathematical statement, it was also a message. If you rearrange the numbers, you get September 10th, 2021. And most people think that that was just a meme, nothing really happened on that day. But, let me tell you, on that day, this kid came down from the heavens, and he bestowed upon me the knowledge on how to prove how 9 plus 10 equals 21 to all of you today. So I hope you have a newfound appreciation for the absolute genius of this kid. So go on and spread the news. 9 plus 10 equals 21.